to my channel. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a GFX with not one, but two rigs. So I have actually gotten this requested a little bit um, on different various videos. Um, so I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do that. And if you don't already know how to make a GFX, I don't think you should watch this yet. I have a video on how to make a GFX. It's pretty simple. Um, I'll link it in the eye in the corner. But yeah, so make sure you know how to make a GFX before you do this because it'll be pretty confusing if you don't already know how. So let's go. All right, so what you're gonna wanna do is go to this link. I have it in my description. It's where you get your rig from. So you're just gonna press download and um i already downloaded it so i'm not gonna do that because i don't want like 50 rigs in my downloads all right so now what you're gonna do is go to your downloads folder and you're gonna see i have like a lot of stuff in here right now but um i have all my default blends right now and this is the latest one i just downloaded and as you can see here, i have this like default copy blend and i'm gonna show you why so what you're gonna do is press default for blend so control and then duplicate and then it's going to make a default for copy blend and then now that we have that we're going to go to blender okay so i loaded in my rig like how i usually would file open default for blend and now we just have our rig so now what i'm going to do is i'm just going to delete the head as I would and so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get ready to load in our second rig so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to file append you don't go to open you go to append and then you get your default copy blend I'm gonna use my default for copy blend and then you press append and then there's going to be all these, but you go to object. And you have to, like, literally select all of them. I just do this by clicking the first one and then going all the way down. And then while and then I click the last one while holding shift and it selects all of them. Okay, so now I append it. And a lot of stuff loads in. Stuff we obviously do not want in our GFX. So I'm actually going to move this rig all the way up there and go down here and you're gonna see you know where the actual because look over here oh my god where am i okay so down here this is the actual like thing that moves your rig around your entire rig so that's why we're gonna go over to our copy blend and we're gonna press it so that we don't end up getting all of this stuff we don't have to delete it section by section so you just click on that and then move your rig over to here. And then you could just go like that and delete. And now you we wanna get rid of these things, so we're just gonna delete them. And what happens for me is when I delete this thing in the mouth, this pops up, so just delete that, and then another one pops up. And then that should be it because now you have your two rigs and then you basically just go about doing how you would normally make a gfx you click here shader editor bottom scroll in oh yeah a lot of people asked me how to zoom in so what you do is you make like your two fingers your middle finger and your pointer finger whatever it's called your index finger and you make like a scissor motion almost and you have to like kind of it's hard to explain but basically i just do it like this and i kind of just like do a scissor motion on the trackpad and it helps me go in but i'm going to get my texture and then you just do the same thing for the other one i'm going to get Mm, Natalie's texture. You should actually go subscribe to her. She has two videos up right now. And she makes really cool content, so you should go subscribe to her. But, um, anyways, now we have our two <laughs> rigs. So that's basically it. That's just how you add on two rigs, and then you would just go about putting your heads on as you normally would. 
it's really it's really just simple that's really it um um anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video i really hope it helped you and if it did let me know in the comments um i am planning to make more tutorials soon sorry this video came out a little late it took longer than i expected and i was a little bit unmotivated to make a video for a little but um yeah i hope you enjoyed and i hope this helped you bye guys